Valve's handheld PC, the Steam Deck is running on a Linux-based operating system. It's no surprise that Valve is leaning into this open-source platform, even if it doesn't have the same clout as Windows. Recently, Valve teamed up with NVIDIA to bring DLSS aka Deep Learning Super Sampling to Linux, adding a major boost to the OS. And now, with the Steam Deck on the horizon, Linux has another reason to celebrate. Let's jump into the detailed discussion on this super spicy topic. A boost in popularity. According to a recent survey on Steam hardware, more gamers are giving Linux a try. It's tough to say for certain, but it looks like the Steam Deck's announcement might be driving this uptick. The report suggests that if Steam's user base averages around 120 million per month, then over 1.2 million of those users are on Linux. That's a 1% market share for Linux, which is a pretty big deal in the open source world. The Linux community is hyped with excitement. Sure, it's not the first time we've seen a spike like this. There was a similar surge a few years back, but it eventually dipped below 1%. Now, with the Steam Deck making headlines and promising a Linux-based OS, it's likely we're seeing history repeat itself, but this time with more momentum. The timing of this increase lines up perfectly with the Steam Deck's buzz, multiplayer game woes, but it's not all smooth sailing. There are some concerns about how well the Steam Deck will handle major multiplayer games. Titles like Call of Duty Warzone and Rainbow Six Siege might struggle on the handheld system. The issue isn't the deck itself, but the anti-cheat software these games use. Many of these anti-cheat systems aren't compatible with Linux, which could pose problems. Hopefully, Valve will sort this out before the Steam Deck hits the market. Multiplayer games are a significant part of the gaming ecosystem. The ability to join friends and compete globally is something many gamers don't want to miss out on. The anti-cheat software incompatibility is a hurdle because these systems are designed to prevent cheating, which is a big deal in competitive gaming. If Valve can't ensure these games run smoothly, it might turn away potential users who are big on multiplayer titles. Changing the game Despite early prototypes of the Steam Deck being described as less than attractive, this device is quickly becoming one of the most talked about gaming machines of the year. It's often compared to the Nintendo Switch due to its design, but Valve's aim is different. They're going after the PC gaming market, not console gamers. This distinction could set the Steam Deck apart and carve out its own niche. The design similarity to the Switch might be skin deep, but the Steam Deck's heart is pure PC. It's like having a full-fledged gaming PC in your hands, capable of running a vast library of games from the Steam Store. This could appeal to gamers who have always wanted the portability of a console but the power and flexibility of a PC. The Steam Deck could potentially bridge that gap, offering the best of both worlds. Looking ahead, the Steam Deck could influence how future gaming devices are designed. If it proves successful, we might see more handheld devices running on Linux, giving the OS even more traction in the gaming world. It also puts pressure on other operating systems to be more adaptable and gamer-friendly. The success of the Steam Deck could lead to innovations and improvements in game compatibility, performance, and overall user experience on Linux. Moreover, the Steam Deck's success could encourage more developers to optimize their games for Linux. This shift could make Linux a more viable gaming platform, attracting a wider audience and fostering a more diverse gaming community. The open source nature of Linux means that it can continually evolve, with contributions from the global community leading to a more robust and feature-rich OS. With its Linux core and the potential to bring PC gaming anywhere, the Steam Deck is poised to make a significant impact. The question remains whether it can overcome the multiplayer game compatibility hurdle, but its influence on the Linux community is already clear. For Linux enthusiasts and gamers looking for a portable PC experience, the Steam Deck could be a game changer. In the end, the Steam Deck is more than just a new gadget. It's a potential catalyst for change in the gaming world. It could redefine portable gaming, push Linux further into the mainstream, and inspire future innovations in the industry. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, drop a comment down below letting us know your thoughts, and of course, subscribe to our channel for more awesome content like this. See you in the next one. Thank you.